Glenfield Boy, Sophie Stenning in the Diamonds of Black and Yellow. I'll Be a Lady, Bredo's Babe, and also uh, Shadow of Fear. They're in the back straight. Two and three quarter laps to complete the assignment. And the arms are about to fold back as the green twinkling light spots us off and away. Cam's a million came out and then broke. So he's in immediate trouble. And Divert's trying to settle him down. And there is a kerfuffle back in the field. Sophie Stenning's also uh, severely inconvenienced. And so too Brados Babe. So three of those in the market have all had their chances affected in the early stages when Cam's a million, I think it was the causer. However, let's get back to the leader. When that settled down, King Cardle has balanced in front and will lead. Ace in our pocket into the first corner. And this pairing come down the lane with two to play. Now Glenfield Boy got the posse available. Leaders back. And they were followed through. On the outside by Swoop to safety. Cam's a million is now pacing much more tractably. Three back on the outside of Shadow of Fear. It's being followed by Tugboat and Brado's Babe. And then Sophie Stenning, who's second last. And I'll Be a Lady also suffered interference. And she's just uh, basically going at three-quarter pace, 100 metres behind them. 44 and 4 was a very slow lead time. And after that early kerfuffle, they've only walked through the first section. And now there's more pace being provided. Johnny Scott's gone around them and is driving viciously and vigorously on Brado's Babe. And Brado's Babe now is able to uh, get down to the marker line in front and shows the way. About to be attacked on the outside again by Ace in our pocket. King Cardle, the early leader, handed up now as leader's back position. It's being followed by on the outside, uh, swooped to safety. And then Glenfield Boy from Cam's a million. Next on the outside was Sophie Stenning, followed by Shadow of Fear. Well back was Tugboat and forget about I'll Be a Lady. They've paced 30 and 8 for the first quarter of the last mile. And Brado's Babe is the leader as they come down to the judge to get the bell. Ace in our pocket is second. King Cardle is third. Swoop to safety is fourth. And then Cam's a million being followed by Glenfield Boy. Second split 30 and 2. They've run 61 for the half. And on the inside, as I said, behind Cam's a million was Shadow Affair from Sophie Stenning. And well back Tugboat. Forget about I'll Be a Lady. Brado's Babe is the leader as they head down the back. Ace in our pocket is second and challenging. And then further back on the outside, Swoop to safety. Cam's a million making an early mistake, is now being revved up around the outside to try and get somewhere near them, and they're being followed by Swoop to safety in the middle. They've run the back straight quarter in 30 and 2, and the leader is still holding on strongly. Brado's Babe has got six metres to show. Ace in our pocket is trying, but is not bridging the gap at the moment, and nothing I don't think will blouse the first two, although Sophie Stenning getting wide out on the camber, starting to run home strongly now. Sophie Stenning is picking them up out wide quick with Shadow Affair and Sophie Stenning. She goes up on the outside and it's going to be Sophie. Darn good job. Got flattened early, recovered and got home to win from uh, Shadow Affair. I think Tugboat will run third. Brado's Babe, Ace in our pocket. Cam's a million blew it at the start. Further back was King Cardle, Glenfield Boy, swooped to safety and I'll be a lady. Did